YouTubers, it's LPS Emily here, back again with another video. Today, I'm going to be doing something slightly different. I wanted to introduce you to a new hobby of mine. So, for the last little bit, I've been collecting um, art toys, some people call them designer toys. I decided to partner with Kika Goods today. They are a website that sells art toys, and they sent me some blind bags to open up for you guys. This isn't paid at all, but I do have a discount code for you guys, which is just LPS Emily, if you're interested in getting some blind bags of your own. I am really happy that I found something new to collect. There's so many different kinds and brands, and um, yeah, I just think art toys are really beautiful and fascinating. Uh, and yeah, thank you to Kika Goods again for partnering with me today, and um, all the links will be in the description if you're interested in checking them out. Let's go! Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and show you the eight blind bags, show you what I got, and then I will go ahead and open them. I'm just going to put her back here for now and go ahead. So here's everything we're going to be opening today. There are a ton of different ones. We have eight separate blind bags, and I'm going to go through and show you everything. Alright, so the first one I want to open is the Azokasan's Daily Life uh, blind bag. Let's, let's give it a little spin to go ahead and see what we can collect. So we got a scared little man. We have little man chasing a little egg thing. We have little man with his little tongue out. Little man with his head in a box. Um, squishy face. Just a curious little guy. And a little surprise kissy one. Uh, he reminds me of my cat and I think he's also flocked, which means that he has this like really cute fluffy exterior, which I'm really excited about. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and cut it off camera. I won't be taking a peek at what's inside of it. I just collect the boxes too because I think they're really clever and pretty and I don't really want to um, wreck the box. But look how cute it also has like a little like Amazon smiley on the top. The whole thing is made like a little box. You found this little guy on the side of the road! So I just cut the box open. The little card is in there. I don't want to look at the card just yet. Let's pull him out. He's a lot bigger than I was expecting. All right, let's see which one we got. Oh, he's in like a little bubble wrap. <gasps> Stop, he's actually so cute. Oh my gosh, and he comes with a little stick. Okay, actually, stop, he's so cute. Oh. See, this is what I mean when I'm talking like designer toys and art toys are so fun to collect. Like, he's so, so soft and precious looking. Like, he's, he's perfect, he's perfect. He comes with a little card, his little mug shot, which I usually put beside them when I have them on display. All right, we have the Lonely Moon Space Ghost Bunny, and I got two of these actually because my partner and I really like the Shinwu series, even though I don't have any of them yet. I just think they're precious. So in the Space Explorer list, there are a bunch of different ones. I love the Moon Miner. I think she's really pretty. Um, Love Shooter, Rainbow Poor. One of my favorite things about Shinwu is that they really go out of their way to make sure like that each model is very different and that it's not just the same model being repainted. They're really, really pretty, so I'm really excited. The Revenger at the bottom is also so precious. All right, let's open the first Lovely Moon Space Ghost Bunny. Okay, I'm gonna open it up. Woo! Again, the packaging for these, they're so creative. They're so beautiful. I really, really appreciate them. Oh my gosh, look how precious. Oh my gosh, it's like, oh my gosh, it's a little bunny. You see the little bunny tail? And it's, he's just inside and he's, he's controlling it. And then we have the little card. There's a little card in here and it's like themed. That is so precious. There's a QR code. There's also a little scratchable thing. Look how cute. Oh my gosh. And now we're on to the second Lonely Moon Space Ghost Bunny blind bag. Let's open this up. Again, bunny moon system. That is so cute. Whoa! Whoa! Oh my gosh. Wow, that's so cool. What? This is so sick. He has his own little card as well. The little moon eraser. He's so cute. They were dating. That is so cool. Okay, 
Next, we're gonna go in with bubble egg. It smells like macaroni in here. No one's making macaroni. That's a problem. <laughs> All right, so the bubble eggs are actually so precious. I love anything pink, so the pink ones are definitely ones that I want. But there's a lot on here. They're they're interesting, but I I like the blushies on this guy. He's so precious. Let me focus on that. They look like little ghosts with like boba inside of them. So I'm really excited, but you can hear it. Okay, okay. Also, again, the box. So cute. All right. Just got the bottom open. <gasps> oh, he's just a little guy. I was so right. His little blush is so cute. Oh my gosh. I like him a lot. He's very like, oh my gosh, kid core. It's so cute. And in the box, it's like he's like a little explorer teacher kid thing. Moving on, we have our last Shinwu blind bag for today. And let's see what we can get. Ooh. The naughty gardener has a nasty secret. I like truth or lie. I like flower grave. Oh my gosh, this is so hype. I love the box. It's very like pastel cottage core. There's a lot of cottage core vibes going on with all of these, I think. All right. <gasps> Ooh, look how beautiful. It's literally just like toy art. It's so good. <gasps> oh, <gasps> oh, she's like a little blueberry. Dude, that's so cool. Okay, I love that so much. That is such a vibe. And of course the little card and it looks like a little stamp and the sides are ruffled like that. All right, we are on our last few. So we have a whisper of flower, which I think is so cool. She is so, so cute. So there's like a little mushroom. There's a rabbit, sunflower, a little butterfly. There's like a honeybee. I think the bear scares me, but the rest of them are so cool and pretty. I think I'd be happy with anything. Again, really pretty packaging. Ooh. He, he's maybe not as creepy as I put him out to be. He's a little creepy. He is, he's a little creepy. He's creepy. He kind of looks like chewed up gum, but he also has no flaws. He's scary. Here is the card for the rose bear. All right, we're gonna go in with bunny fantasy. I'm so excited about this one. I don't really have any that I dislike. They're all really, really pretty. The packaging is beautiful. Oh my gosh. I think these are uh, plushies as well. So the, I, they look really soft. I'm really excited. All right, so is in a big container here. Oh! Oh! <gasps> okay, actually, wait, stop. I love, look how cool. It's got little feet. I love how creepy it is. And also just like really beautiful. It's such a gorgeous blue color and it is like it's as soft as like a jelly cat blush. Like it is so, so soft. And on the back, like little ears, there is a little bow and wings. This is, I believe, the bigger um, one out of the two. I believe there's one that's a little bit smaller. Oh my gosh, really cool. Like look at the detail in the face. It's so creepy, I love it. It's so cute. It's bunny shaped, yeah. Alrighty, the last one. It's the KK Zoo, yeah! This is probably the one I like the most, other than like the ram and the fox. They're so cute. These are precious. I didn't think it was gonna be so big. I like the dinosaur as well, but it is quite big. It is probably the size of my two hands. So I'm gonna open this one. All right, let's open this one up. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, wait! Oh my gosh, he's so pink. He's just a little pig. He is so precious, I love him. Anyways, thank you guys for joining me today and unboxing these art toys. I really appreciate you sticking around to watch my videos still. And uh, yeah, I'm really happy with what I got. So 
I hope that you can find something that you like as well on Kika Goods. Uh, I really like all these. So thank you. All right, bye.